Hello everyone there, it's Nate here. I'm going to give you a full review of all the weapons and little tips and tricks how to get them. Before I say this, stay t tuned to the uh, end of the video. I have a little holiday greeting I like to say. But um, Okay, let's start off with the first weapon. The FAMAS. Um, first of all, this weapon is pretty much great in any game. I mean, it's so... It's rate of fire so fast and it's pretty accurate. Um, to unlock it, 10 revives, 10 heals. It's pretty easy. You can pretty much do it on any map, but if you want to go fast, I recommend Operation Metro. Just close quarters combat usually is pretty easy. Um, to get it, the more advanced gun, the L85A2. Um, this one was kind of difficult to unlock, but it just really took a little bit of time. The 100 kills with the assault rifle, you know, you're just going to kill with that. It's not a big deal. Uh, the 20 kills with the grenade launcher, like I said, close quarters, whatever map you is closer. Again, Operation Metro is a good one. And a tricky one, uh, the win five rounds of squad deathmatch. I didn't really have any one of my friends to help me on this, so I just kind of did it until I found the right party. But if you don't have people on your friends list to help you, it could take a while, but it's not that hard. Uh, moving on to the HK-53. I really like this weapon. Um, up close, it really, with the right attachments like silencer and pistol grip and some other things, it's pretty good. I really like it for close quarters, but um, every time I was on a map that was far ranged, um, it got owned every time, but it's a pretty decent weapon. I like it. Um, the 10 repairs, go to a vehicle map, you know, it's not a big deal. Kill one enemy with repair torch. I recommend Operation Firestorm or any map that has high level of sniper activity. Um, I went up behind a sniper and pretty much blow, blow torched them. That's how I unlocked that one. Um, going down to the QBZ 95B. This one, in my opinion, was probably the hardest to unlock. Um, starting off with the 50 AT rocket kills. It just took a lot of time. Um, like I said, I went to Operation Metro to get most of these, but I ca you can kind of throw in most of the achievements if you think about it. So I got some on other maps I was trying to get other things done with. but um, So that was pretty hard. You destroy one enemy with vehicle... Or, yeah, the vehicle with repair torch. That one took me forever. Um, you pretty much have to get in a, ve a map with high vehicle flow. And it's just pretty much luck. Either someone's going to stay in there while you do it, or they jump out. So it, that one's probably the hardest, in my opinion, out of all of these. But it's doable. Um, and win five rounds of conquest, that's probably that's easy. So you'll get that pretty fast. <clears throat> Moving on to the QBB95. Uh, this gun, I didn't really like... It's more a mix of an assault rifle and light machine gun. Um, for its rate of fire, I think the amount of damage it does is not really good. I didn't really like it. It's slower, but I mean, it's really up to you how you play. Um, 20 kills with the machine, light machine gun, that was easy. And the mortar kills, um, usually I do like a rush with it or something. Just click like... Uh, like Wake Island or something, and you can get or any map really for the more kills. Um, moving down to the MG36, this gun I really like. Mostly in most games that have it, um, it's pretty good. Good rate of fire, does a lot of damage. All around good weapon um, for unlocking it. The 100 kills, the light machine gun. Like I said, it's just gonna take a little time to get that one down. The suppression assist, you'll get that with most everyone you get so that one will come in time and the 50 ammo resupplies you need to just always be thrown down your ammo pack like i said operation metro i got most of this done so try that um for the qbu 88 i for the semi-auto i think this is probably the best sniper rifle for the semi-autos it shoots really smooth it's really nice um i really liked it and I would pick, it's not my choice, I love the bolt actions, but still, this one, I like the feel of this one. Um, 20 kills with the sniper rifle, easy. And the five, five laser designations, like I said, I got that on Operation Firestorm. Just set up, and that one's pretty easy. Um, moving down to the L96. This one kind of took me a little bit of time, but it wasn't that bad. Uh, the 50 headshots, you'll get that as time goes on. The 50 spot assists. Um, you can either do it manually with the select button, or you can use, um, I forget what it is, that little flying robot that helps. And the five knife takedowns, that's easily accomplished. On to the PP-19. I actually really enjoyed this weapon. Its rate of fire is ridiculous, 900. And it holds 50 rounds, so this is pretty much close combat. You're going to 
either kill them or run out of ammo. It's a really nice weapon. Um, I really liked it. Like I said, it's not really far range, but it's it's really good. Um, the Arm 10 MCOMs, you're just going to have to do Search and Destroy for that one. Capture 10 Flags, pretty easy. And the one that got me, that kind of got me, was play 2 hours on Karkin, but I mean... If you only play those maps, you'll, you know, you'll knock it. And now to the last one, the MK3A1. Um, this weapon is nice, I like it, but I like all shotguns pretty much in BF3. They all have their strengths and weaknesses. I, I don't think I dislike a shotgun. This one is all around good shotguns, just like the others. Um, it's not the fastest, does some good damage. Um, found lock it, the 10 kills with the PP19, that was fun, easy. Five kills in DBV Jeep, go to like, um, go off of Oman and just run people over. That's what I did. The 10 kills in BTR-90 IFE, you're going to want to go to Conquest and go off of Oman and get on the uh, Russian side, and that's where it spawns. Just kill people in that. And then for the two hours on both maps, that's all you're going to do. So This is pretty much the weapons, and it only took me probably a couple weeks to unlock, but then again, I was busy with a lot of stuff. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks, guys. Hi there everyone, it's Nate here. Um, I just like to say thank you for watching the videos and have a Merry Christmas. Um, I've been drinking 40s lately, but I thought I'd get down with a little Jim Beam today. Come, have a drink with me. Thank you for watching the videos. I appreciate it. Stay tuned for more. Cheers.